I saw them come in with their jackets, Kyle. Yeah, another chilly day on the outside. They'll need it as they leave. They'll need it again tomorrow. And then finally on Wednesday, we will be able to get things warmed up here. Good afternoon to you, everyone. Heather Haley out speaking to another group of kids here this afternoon at school. And uh, we have a cold day for everyone to be on the outside. How frosty was it in your neighborhood? Well, this is from Jennifer over in Blunt County. And you can see there the frost all over on the ground there as the sun came up this morning. You'll see this picture again for our Tuesday morning as well. Hope your day uh, starts off warm on the inside and, and then we'll get over to Thanksgiving, which looks to be a lot better. The Follett, you'll be at 39 degrees for the outside right now. It's 42 in Andersonville, 40 for Corrington and Knoxville, as well as Maryville, 42 for Farragut, 42 degrees over in Oak Ridge, and 38 degrees in Lenore City. You spread the picture out, it's 38 in Johnson City, 43 down to Chattanooga. 48 for Nashville as well as Columbia. Already the Carolinas are cool as well today. 44 degrees over in the Charlotte. You can see we have clear skies overhead here uh, today. These clear skies will be continuing with us. We broaden the picture out. High pressure and dominant control here of the southeastern area. And we have clear skies all the way back out the west through Texas or whatever. So a couple of days or so before we'll be seeing anything in the way of cloud cover and shower activity. High pressure will be giving us more of a southwesterly flow here and that will increase our temperatures over the next couple of days. You'll see on the planning forecast how that just continues here through the next couple of days. You'll see here at 5 o'clock this afternoon, clear skies. Futurecast paints this all out very well here. By the afternoon and evening hours, we continue to see clear skies that allow us to cool very nicely here during the overnight hours. We broaden the picture out, and there's still not much to talk about even by Tuesday afternoon. Just a couple of passing clouds will be coming through the Tennessee Valley area here over the next couple of days or so. Maybe Wednesday late, especially on Thursday, we'll start increasing the cloud cover and a chance of rain is in the forecast here as we head towards our weekend. Okay, here in southeastern Kentucky today, we'll warm to 45 degrees in London. It's going to be chilly. 47 for Williamsburg, 46 Barberville, 48 for Middlesbrough. It's going to be a sunny day. We could see some gusts up to 20 miles per hour across the area. Down along the plateau, we should warm to 45 in Jamestown, Clark Range, 46 for Crossville, 47 for Rockwood, 48 degrees Kingston and La Follette, 46 for Oneida. Sunshine continues across the area here down into the valley. We should warm to 49 degrees. That's all we can muster in Knoxville today. It'd be 50 in Oak Ridge, 49 for Loudoun, 48 for Maynardville and Dandridge, 47 Morristown and Tazewell, and over into the Smokies, a gusty day here as well if you're up in the higher elevations, 41 for Gatlinburg to 47 Sevierville, 48 for Maryville, 49 degrees over into Madisonville, Teleco Plains, good afternoon to you, should be about 46 by the afternoon. Tonight, clear and cold, 28 degrees for an overnight low, not out of the question, we could be near 20, the upper teens in some areas across the area, that's why we'll have another the local late weather alert for you tomorrow morning. Be careful of the frost on the outside. So we're dropping to a cold night. Tuesday warms very nicely into the low 50s, back down above freezing overnight Tuesday. Then for Wednesday, we'll be in the upper 50s. Sunshine and check out the Thanksgiving forecast. Not bad. Friday, we start clouding up, getting ready for some rain that could be here over the weekend on into Monday. But Marco, I know a lot of people are making plans for their two, their Thursday Thanksgiving. Here we go. Here's the forecast. About 63 degrees, mostly sunny skies and seasonable, so you're able to get outside and enjoy Thanksgiving here this week. And if you're making plans for the holidays, we've got something festive for you. Coming up next here on Local 8 News at Noon. We hope you'll stick with us.